Hi Harrison, hope you're all well at home. Today I've got for you a little challenge to help you to look out for angles around your home. So to do this, we're first we're going to make an angle eater. So you need something circular. You might want to use a roll of sellotape. Um, I've got a little pot here. Um, I've got some cards, but paper will do the job and then a pen or a pencil. So you need to pop your circular item on your piece of paper or card and draw all the way around it. Okay, so a circle and then use some scissors to cut out your circle. If you are in the lower school, you might want to get an adult to give you a helping hand with this part. And you need to cut it out really carefully so you've got a really exact circle. And then you can put those bits to one side. And then an angle is something which you can measure. So you have two lines and it is the turn, the rotation of those two lines. And it's how big that rotation is. So to help us, we're going to fold our circle first of all in half. And then I'm going to fold it in half again. So I've put it into quarters. And then when I unfold it, I'm going to cut out one of those quarters. So I'm going to cut up one line there into the middle and then into the middle again. Oh, this needs to go a little bit further on that side. And I wonder if you can tell me what angle I've made here. It's the sort of angle that I might find on the corner of a piece of paper. Mm -hmm. Or I might find it over here on the shelf of the library. Um, or I might find it over here on the window. Even on a book, Miss Bridges. Even on a book as well. <laughs> Same with books all around the library. Thanks, Mrs. Trump. <laughs> so, did I hear you say right angle? Because if you did, then you're absolutely correct. So our angle eater, and I'm going to give him a little eye to make him look like a little Pac-Man helps us to find right angles really easily. So you could have a hunt around your house. How many different right angles can you fa find? I haven't gone very far in the library at all and I've already found one, two, three, four different right angles. But there's other types of angle as well. I'll give you a moment just to have a little bit of a think. What are those other angles called? And you have angles which are smaller than a right angle and angles which are bigger than or greater than a right angle. So those ones, the smaller one is called acute. Okay, I like to think of them as being small and cute angles. And then the larger angles we call obtuse angles. I wonder if you remembered those words. But you can use your angle eater to have a look for some of those as well. So let's see what we can find. Even I could start up here and I could pop my angle eater there. And I've already found an angle which is acute because it doesn't go as far as the right angle does. I wonder if I can find some more what is around here in our library. Oh, I found another right angle over here. Can you see that, Mrs. Trump? Mm -hmm. There's a right angle just oh, there. Yes. Absolutely. Why oh, don't you know, just spot on the oh, about this one over here? And what the arrow is. Oh, it's another right angle. I was hoping it might be a little bit bigger. What about, oh, it's got to be some straight lines that I'm looking for. But over here, oh, we've got lots of right angled arrows around the place in our library. Oh, can you spot, oh, I wonder what this part is. Oh, it's still, still slightly smaller, so it's another acute one. But mm -hmm. it's still a bit bigger than that acute angle there. Somewhere there's got a. Oh, I wonder if I could use one of these folders to make one. So I could have it as a bit of a right angle. But if I opened it out, maybe that's cheating a little bit. <laughs> but I've definitely found that I could be making an angle there. A very full file would make it. It is, absolutely. Obtuse. Yeah. Oh, I wonder where. What about over here on the wall? Oh, Mrs. Trump likes to come around this okay. side, I think. Definitely, 
I've got the lines here from here and there's my point and there's my other line. I've definitely found myself an obtuse angle there and another one up here because mm -hmm. the line goes past my right angle. Yeah, well found. So, definitely found some different angles. I wonder how many acute right and obtuse angles you can find around your house. I wonder if you can find more obtuse angles than me. I found that one really tricky. You could look in your garden as well um, and let us know any which you manage to find. Have fun angle hunting. <laughs>